welcome to the show, Ronnie's This and That, where I got this little bit of time to bug you about a lot of that in my life. And that being said, welcome to your Tilted Thursdays. Bam! This is today's crap. I leveled up. Level up! Went from the porch to the couch. What? Level up! Anyway, with that being said, I'm really moving up in the world, don't you think? Nah, it's just a little bit more better digs. Anyway, uh, the next crap. Let's talk presidents. Let's not. Okay, thank you. Moving on. Cheers. Pinky out. Anyway, the last crap, or the last wipe I like to call it at the end of this today's crap segment, is not what I thought. Apparently is a hand-drawn turkey. Tis a season, I guess. No, not what I wanted. Anyway, let's see behind door number two. There it is. Don't see me, Lucky Charms, but I love your honey, Lucky Charms. <laughs> uh, probably known to a lot of you guys. Brand new treasure to me. What can I say? They're magically delicious. Don't see me. This is not a paid advertisement. Anyway, well, with today's crap being over, I'm going to give you guys the little hint to the daily challenge. And that's going to include stuff that clowns do. Hmm. And potatoes. I wonder what it could be. Huh. Anyway, on to Soup Thoughts. Woo! Welcome to Soup Thoughts. Stoop thought number one, if cats are all a-holes and women love cats, does that explain their taste in man? Hmm. Stoop thought number two, why is it that bears are the only thing people are concerned about crapping in the woods? Hmm. Number three, why is it so hard to fall asleep and easy to wake up? And vice versa. Your thought is mine! Whoo, just got back surfing the Milky Way like an old 90s song. Let me know if you get the reference in the comments below. Anyway, welcome to Nerd Space. My Nerd Space is, well, nerd and geek put together makes nerd. And this is my space. Nerd space. This is where I get to kind of share with you guys some of the nerdy geeky stuff I'm doing or into at the moment. Uh, so, with that being said, I have found a really cool treasure I want to share with you guys today. Tent number two, see if that works. There we go. Um, something, yeah, I think I really like, especially in, from the 90s and probably a boy. <laughs> uh, three, two, here we go. All right. <laughs> What a delay. That's right. Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles and the Power Rangers did a crossover comic. Awesome. Awesome. This is actually the third cover out of five. And as you can see, yes, Shredder gets the Green Ranger powers. Kind of like what brings everything together. I do not want to ruin these comics for you. So I'm not going to give you too much information because I would really want you guys to help the industry by going to either A, buy the comic, or at least trying to go somewhere where you can read it and help them out in some type of way. Anyway, what I will give off is this is not, this is not the first time they've done this. If I did my research correctly, back in 1998, Space Rangers did a crossover with, I think it was called Shell Shocked with the Teenage you know, Turtles. But in comic book form, I believe this is like their first series. Anyway, that being said, uh, a big thing and a big question you're probably wondering, well, there's five rangers and four turtles. Who's the fifth person for the turtles? Because the turtles do get their own Power Ranger suits. That I'm not going to tell you. That you have to read the comic to find out. Anyways, that being said, uh... If you like the Batman crossover, you're going to really love this because they really do hit all the points. They hit your nostalgia right where it hurts. And 
I really hope one day I own all of these. So that being said, on to the next one. Okay, so here we are at the daily challenge. And that's why I've been wearing these shorts this entire episode. Because just in case it gets messy. <laughs> Um, if you're wondering why he's wearing a nice black little shirt and a paint covered shorts. Anyway, like I said, today's segment is clowns and potatoes. That being said, let's get to the challenge. I got to juggle uh, these three potatoes to prevent myself from Woo! Gonna get in the face with shaving cream. With a paper plate. So. Basically, I'm gonna count to one Mississippi because I got no one here to time me. But. If I don't want a shaving cream pie to the face with soothing aloe. I will have to sit here, and I'm not going to ruin this, so we're going to the shirt underneath. Boom. If I can juggle this, or I will go one minute, because I know how to juggle, so we're going to go one minute. If I can juggle these for one minute, counting the one Mississippi, I won't get it high to the face. Alright, so here we go. One Mississippi, two Mississippi, three Mississippi, four Mississippi, five Mississippi, six Mississippi, seven Mississippi, eight Mississippi, nine Mississippi, ten. Okay, a little too easy. I guess I really know how to juggle. So to kind of smooth things along and to make it a little harder challenge, after five Mississippis, I got to close my eyes. Try again. So. One Mississippi, two Mississippi, three Mississippi, four Mississippi, five Mississippi, and that was immediately over. <laughs> One more time. One Mississippi, two Mississippi, three Mississippi, four Mississippi, five Mississippi, six. and immediately I failed it. Okay. Being the first episode and all, and I don't have much help for a challenge. I can still kind of whoop, 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 show off my juggling skills ah, that I don't have. Okay, okay, okay. The moment we're waiting for. Are you happy yet? <laughs> oh, we made it to the end of the first episode. <clears throat> we figured out that we leveled up and that we don't like to juggle with our eyes closed and shaving cream sticks a lot better than you think. Anyway, um, that being said, I really hope you guys enjoyed yourself. I hope you learned something. I hope you laughed about something. Either way, I hope something happened. <laughs> Um, in the future, these will get better. I'll get better practice, so just bear with me. Um, and if there's anything from a challenge you want to see to something you want me to talk about, um, even if you want to correct me, because it's not that hard to do, <laughs> leave it in the comment section below. I'll get to it. I'll try my best. Uh, if anybody wants to join me as a special guest, anybody wants to come over, feel free to... Do the same thing down below. And if you're watching this on YouTube, well, then you already know what to do. Down below. Like and subscribe. This is Ronnie's This and That. And now you had this. And I gave you that. Have a good day. What do you want from me? No, really, have a good day.